now there's a basic smart lock coming from Amazon and we're gonna do a little bit of an unboxing and see what's inside and I'm gonna try to install this uh, on my door so here's the model number yeah we have some used manual there uh, nice uh, comes with some screw well it's a Phillips screwdriver and some the mounting options uh, a shaft lock for it oh it comes also with the drill bit it's good and mounting pl mounting plate and here oh, it has a gasket so also has some gasket and pads. Nice. And we have here the handbar side. And it comes with the gateway too. Awesome. So inside the packet, um, you have these templates for the door. So. You could easily attach all of the, uh, you know, to determine the location and the mountings of the whole lock. But the bottom, you have the user manual. So, <clears throat> as you can see here, um, so this is lying with the edge of the door. And the current hole that I have there is smaller than what is required so we need to enlarge this hole a little bit to that diameter to 2.13 inches so it's about 2 and 1 8 so I will be enlarging the hole using this uh, miles craft drill guide so to make sure that it's perfectly uh, aligned because um, it's all it already has a hole in it so basically if um, if you're drilling this hole from um, from a door, it has this drill bit inside of it that sort of like aligns it. But if you're gonna be drilling with a hole already and trying to enlarge it, you know this hole hole hole, hole drill bit hole saw will actually move and you're not gonna be able to align it properly. So. That's why you need this uh, drill guide. So now we have enlarged the hole and added uh, another hole on top of it uh, to secure because it's an elongated lock with the keypad. First we have to install the deadbolt. So as mentioned here, um, it should be, this side should, gonna be, should be up. It goes up. So you should insert it like so. It, like so. I actually had it on a setback of 60 mm. Okay. So now we've mounted the front plate into the hole. So the wire should, have, should go underneath. Then we put the mounting plate. The front is so I fixed it. Mounting plate is now mounted, so the wire should go here. The wire should go off from here, and then we'll attach it to this connector right over there. Okay. Once we mount the, and then mount this as so the internal uh, plate or the inter internal device. All right. So now we've mounted it. So. We'll Let's put some batteries. So now we have installed it. So Good. 
Creed.